We are the five awesome heroes. Welcome to our show. Hi, everyone. I'm Emily Anderson with the Bridging Program, back again to be making more TV shows with the students in Community Connections. Today, um, you've already met the five awesome heroes, or four of the awesome heroes, and peer mentor Mieva. Uh, we are um, embarking on a new project. Last year, students interviewed and were interviewed by activist uh, David Fry. He has already been working with our students this year, inspiring them to tell their stories. And we are going to start off with peer mentor Mieva sharing her story, and then she will hear the stories of the other students. And meanwhile, talk a little bit about why it's important for why David, David Fry really believes in people telling their stories as um, people with disabilities, telling stories helps people change their minds and realize there are um, more ways that we are alike than not alike. And this can change laws, this can change policies, and this can make our world even more accessible for everyone. So. Here is Peer Mentor Mieva. And here's Peer Mentor Mieva. Hi. I just want to also acknowledge this really great artwork that the group created when they first went out in the community at Topaz Weiss's Expressive Arts Burlington. So this is the work of the five awesome heroes. But Mieva, please share us your story. Mieva was part of the workshop with David Fry, wrote her story, and I felt it was a great way to start things off today. Hi, my name's Mieva. I was born in Maine after a few years from living in San Diego. I moved to Vermont. My dream was to go to a public high school. It came true. During high school, I mentored the sweet this sweet girl who had autism like me. I helped her with friendship skills and sharing by interacting with her. And I realized that's what I want to do. I want to work with kids and young adults with disabilities like me. That's so beautiful, Mieva. I love, first, I always love what you write. You're so clear. You're such a, a wonderful expressor of your experience. And I love that now, you, last year you were in the bridging program as a high school student with a disability and you are now, have been hired back to be a peer mentor and be a, a support for the students um, in a way that, you know, I can't, I can't give the students the same sort, sort of support that you can because you have been in the program you also share things with the students that I don't. So I love that you are living your dream, and I'm glad to be a part of it. And I, um, I'm just wondering if there's anything you'd like to add to the importance of sharing your story. Like, what else? Um, why is it important for people, for young people with disabilities to share their story? Um, yesterday I was writing something at my respite's house and the, her kids were like, Mieva, what are you writing? And I'm like, we all have a story. They're like, what's a story? And I believe we all, we all have a story to share with the world so they can understand who we are and they don't judge us for our differences, disability or not. I believe we're all a lot alike from one Beautiful. another. You are, yeah. you are such an inspirational speaker, Mieva. Um, well, I know there are other awesome heroes that are ready to share their story with you, so I'm going to snap out and someone else will snap in. You ready? Okay. Mm -hmm. Will you snap me out? Hi, my name is Mieva. I'm a peer mentor. I'm here with Kabrithika today to share her story. Okay.
my my story in i like to watch ball i like was the captain to for my captain i like bowling i like math class i like to dance to macarena i like to dance with rose and i like to going to the mall i like to watch the movie i like i like pizza thank you korazaka for sharing um i have a question for you yeah what do you like about is it called bocce bocce ball or something yeah what do you like about it how does it make you feel when you do it like as a hobby it's bocce ball yeah how does it make you feel happy thank you so much for sharing My name is Mieva. I'm here with Cadence today to uh, share her story. Um, I'm going to read my I am poem thing with a call. Um, the first one is I am kind and I am person and my person. The second one I wondered which I don't know. Um, the the number three, I heard cars. I see flowers and guys. Um, the fifth one, don't know. And the sixth one, I'm kind, nice, and my person. Um I have a question for you. What what were you thinking that inspired you when you were writing your poem? Like the things you shared, what inspired you to write them? What inspired me was that I had a good feeling of writing because it definitely helped me. writing yeah cool um it definitely helped me when i do like a hard time or like some short yeah. yeah thank you so much for sharing cadence thank you you're welcome Hi, my name is Mieva and I'm here with Carlton today to share his story. Hi, my name is Carlton Pham. I am 20 years old. I was born in Tunisia in Vermont. I live with my parents and my brother in Colchester. I like to play PS1 and do yoga. My favorite food is noodles. I have a job at Resource and Wheels in Vermont. My favorite music group and artists are Rapidos and uh, Jackson 5. Thank you so much Carlton for sharing. Yes. I have a question for you. You you wrote about um some hobbies in there. What what's your favorite hobby to do? Okay, um my favorite hobby are I want a spicy noodle. I'm a boy and a student. Thank you, Carlton, for sharing. Yes. Okay. Aww. I'm 
here with Autumn to share her story today. <laughs> I am kind and smart and beautiful. I wonder what my job will be. I hear an airplane. I see my grandma. I want to go to college. I am kind and smart and beautiful. I love dragonflies. I have a question for you. What do you like about dragonflies? Dragonflies are round in the sky. Thank you for sharing, Autumn. <laughs> Hi, my name is Mieva. I'm here to represent Gray today, who is apparently not here, but he's an amazing friend, he's really funny, and he loves to do art and color rainbows. At Bridging, we have this wall full of rainbows of Gray's artwork. I think he's a great artist and an amazing person. Thank you everyone for watching!